Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're answering a question a lot of you have asked. Which rendering software should you be using? We'll be comparing four of the industry's biggest players, namely V-Ray, Enscape, Corona Render, and Lumion, to help you decide which one fits your workflow, your style, and your needs. If you're into videos that make your drafting process easier, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more tips and tool reviews. All right, enough of that. Let's get started. Let's be real, choosing rendering software can be overwhelming. Every platform claims to be the best, but which one actually works for you? In this video, we'll break down the pros and cons of each option, and by the end, hopefully, you'll have a clearer idea of what's worth your time and money. First, let's set some expectations. There's no one-size-fits-all when it comes to rendering softwares. The best choice depends on your project type, experience level, workflow, and hardware. And remember, amazing renders come from a mix of software and skill, composition, lighting, and storytelling. That's all that matters. So as we go through each option, think about what matters most to you. Is it speed, realism, budget, or ease of use? Let's start with a quick overview of the four rendering softwares we'll be comparing for this video. First up, we have V-Ray. It's one of the most widely used rendering tools in architecture and even for visual effects. Known for its incredible photorealism and flexibility, V-Ray supports a wide range of plugins and modeling platforms. It's a paid software, but highly respected across the industry. Next is Enscape. Enscape is all about speed and real-time visualization. It integrates seamlessly with tools like Revit and SketchUp, making it a fan favorite for quick walkthroughs and live client presentations. It's also a paid platform, but very beginner-friendly. Then we have Corona Render. Corona is focused heavily on architectural visualization. It's simple to use, delivers stunning photorealistic results, and is surprisingly easy for beginners to pick up. Like the others, it's paid, but less complicated than something like V-Ray. Sorry, V-Ray. And finally, we have Lumion. Lumion is your go-to for fast, beautiful exterior renders. It shines in real-time rendering, has a massive built-in asset library, and is super easy to learn. It's great for designers who want impressive visuals quickly, with less technical setup as well. Now that we've got the high-level view, let's take a deeper look at how each one fits into different workflows. First, we have V-Ray. It's perfect for architects and professionals looking for high-end realism. The pros are that it's an industry standard. It integrates with tools like SketchUp, 3D Max, and Rhino. It also has exceptional light and shadow accuracy. The cons are that it has a steep learning curve and it's subscription required. Then we have Enscape. This is best for real-time design and quick client presentations. The pros for this is seamless integration with Revit, SketchUp, and Rhino, and the real-time feedback while modeling. Now the cons for Enscape is it has fewer advanced settings than V-Ray, and it's also a paid license. But they all are, so let's just take that into consideration. Then we have Corona Render. This is ideal for architectural visualization artists who want photorealism without the complexity. The pros for this software is we have great results with less tweaking and an intuitive interface which is easy even for beginners. The cons is it's also paid and it doesn't have as much integration as V-Ray. Lastly, we have Lumion which is perfect for designers who need a fast beautiful renders without a steep learning curve. The pros are it has real-time rendering, it's easy to learn, and it has a massive asset library. The cons are it has less technical control, and it's also paid. Now, to choose what's best for you, ask yourself, what kind of projects do I do the most? Architecture? Interiors? Exteriors? Do I need real-time feedback or ultra-realistic visuals? What's my budget? 
Am I a beginner or an advanced user? What kind of hardware am I working with? Pro tip, most of these tools offer free trials, of course, so test them out before you commit. You'll learn quickly which interface feels intuitive and which fits your workflow. Don't forget, the best rendering software isn't always the most expensive. It's the one that helps you tell your story clearly, efficiently, and impressively. All right, so I think we're done with that. Here's a quick recap. If you're just starting out, go for Corona or Lumion. If you need real-time rendering for quick walkthroughs, try Enscape or Lumion. If you want top-tier realism and flexibility, try V-Ray or Corona. But whatever you choose, the right tool is the one that makes your creative process smoother and helps bring your visions to life. And that's it. Let us know in the comments which rendering software you use and why. We'd love to hear from you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and tell us what you want us to deep dive into next. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.